What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Tony TV and I am back with another video, man. Today video I'm making some more shrimp fettuccino. <laughs> yeah boy. You alright, Rico? <laughs> I was wondering what that noise was. That was my dog. But yeah, I got the fire. Not the fire, but I got the I got the uh, butter going. I got the shrimp here. Now, now I'm gonna pull that shrimps in here. I got a little bit of garlic sauce. I should have had more garlic salt, not sauce. I should have, I thought I had more, but this is all I got. So, this is what I'm working with. And a little bit of pep pep. So, let me open this up. That's why I told him to stop coming in here. That's literally all I got. That's not nothing. All right, I'm gonna add a little bit of pepper to it. So, um, you put y'all down so y'all can see the pepper going in. That's the pepper. Add it in there. Wish I had more garlic salt because um, I like a lot of garlic salt on my um, on my shrimp, my sauteed shrimp. So I already checked. I checked the whole thing. What about if I use? I don't want to use no seasoning on. But I'm gonna do the best I can, guys, with a little bit that I got. But um. Yeah, I'm gonna let these. Um, I'm gonna let these uh, warm up a little bit, and I'll show y'all when they're getting uh, steamed and hot. All right, guys, I got the shrimp frying up, and I got the broccoli out. So we're gonna have broccoli with our meal. We're gonna mix the broccoli in with all that stuff. So got the shrimp. I can't talk. We got the shrimp got frying the shrimp. up. <laughs> the shrimp. <laughs> We got the broccoli. Alright guys, I've been cooking these shrimps for a good while. They're popping. Yeah, they about done. You don't want to overcook shrimp like I know. 
I know how to cook shrimp. But I'm going to show you all the shrimps. Don't they look good? The broccoli is almost done. This, yeah, I would say this is almost done. Almost. About another minute or so. But yeah, these are almost done. And then what you want to do is, when you're done cooking the shrimp, you want to put them on a plate, spread them out, let them cool off. Then you want to peel them. Peel all your shrimps. Then, if you want to throw them in your fettuc in your fettuccine noodles whole, you can do that. Or you can cut them up in, in a half. That's what I do. I normally cut them in half because I got the big shrimps. Like, I don't know if y'all can see this, but these shrimps are pretty big. Cause we like I'm like I said, I'm feeding five people, so you might want to cut them up in half. More more happier go around. You know that don't make sense. The more the merrier. Yeah, let's put it like that. All right. Um. See that? Want to wait until they get nice? See that brown? Y'all see that brown stuff? That's when you know you saw paint. If it ain't brown, you ain't saltine. <laughs> yeah, boy. I'll tell you that now. Because these are just as done. See, yeah, I missed one. I'm going to flip that bad boy over let that salt take. Yeah. Voila. Salty shrimps. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to, um, alright, I'll show y'all what I do. Alright, so. I'm gonna get me a plate. If I need two. Two plates. Yeah. Set these plates down. I'm gonna take the salt to the front. Did I put the cover on? Fine, babe. Alright. So you want to put them on the plate. Let me do it this way. Let them spread out so they have time to cool down so you can start peeling them. Two hours later. Hey guys. So we're gonna let those cool off for about 10 minutes and I'm gonna start peeling them. Then the wife is gonna get the noodles going and the broccoli is done. That'll be going into the pot and I'll be back. Alright guys, <laughs> the shrimp is cooling off. And the noodles are getting added. I got too hot for you. Oh, I had to turn it on. Uh, Did you get that? I didn't see. Um, I'll show y'all what sauce. We use the sauce. If you're ever thinking about making uh, shrimp Alfredo, this is really good sauce to use. It tastes really good. And you won't have no regrets using that Alfredo sauce because that be really good. Really, really good. You heat it up. <laughs> Every time I cook, he's he's in the kitchen just staring. Hope, hoping somebody call him. Yeah. Too bad he ain't gonna get no shrimps today. But um, all right, I'm gonna go ahead and finish up the noodles and the sauce. Oh, 
remember we got adding broccoli. Let me hold it more steadier. Keep shaking. I got to remember. I got to stop shaking. Remember we adding the broccoli to the Alfredo. So I'll show y'all the mixing process when it's uh, that time. I need to start doing mukbangs. I want to start doing mukbangs. I even got stuff to do mukbangs with, like bowls and dishes, so y'all can see the food. But it's trying to step my game up, but I haven't been able to get there. Perfect. I do want to. I, I, I'll get there. All right, guys. That's Alfredo night. I hope you guys learned how to make some good Alfredo. Um, if you got any questions or anything, let me know in the comment section below and I'll be happy to ask them. Um, and that's it. Shrimp Alfredo. Smash that like button. Yep, and hit that subscribe button. Help them out. <laughs> and I'm gone.